welcome to the next installment of Burger Bites with Todd. In today's video, we'll answer the question, how do I make sure my burgers are as juicy as possible? One thing that you'll never see me do is squish the burger down. That is the cardinal sin of making grass-fed burgers. The last thing that I want to do is to squeeze out the juiciness, the moisture, and the fat, the beneficial fat, that's in grass-fed beef. I'm not sure where that, that tradition got started, but I'd love to just kill it right now. Don't ever, ever do that to this incredible, uh, incredible grass-fed beef that you've bought. Don't move it around on the grill. Flip it over once and leave it alone. Every time you touch it, you lose the moisture, some of the moisture and some of the fat. And interestingly, it's the fat that's in our grass-fed beef that's got all the, all the benefits to eating grass-fed beef are in the fat. Uh, the fat has all the fat-soluble vitamins. It, it's all, all the minerals are in the fat. The omega-3 fats are in there. So I don't want to lose any of that, and I want to cook my burgers with the minimal amount of, of touch and disruption. So don't, don't move them around, don't slide them around, and certainly don't press on them to try to squeeze the moisture out of them. Thank you for watching today's Burger Bite with Todd. If you have additional questions, feel free to reach out to us through our website at bluenestbeef.com, on our Facebook page, or by simply leaving a comment below. Please be sure to like this video and subscribe to hear more Burger Bites with Todd. Also, check out these additional videos to learn more today.